Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'll be doing a little Walmart haul. So y'all already know I have a shopping problem. It's okay, it's okay. Because I'm here to show you. Because I have no one else to show because we're in a pandemic. Anyways, let's get started. The first thing I got are these wax melts. And oh my god, you guys. I am obsessed with both of these scents. Like, apple cinnamon, you can't go wrong with. But this one... The apple orchard oh my god it smells like real apples so if you like how apples smell definitely try this I already been burning it it's my favorite guys I just love it it doesn't smell too strong it just smells perfect next thing I got is my all-time favorite makeup item of the world my Milani conceal and perfect shine proof powder and this one's in zero two nude so i think this one's my best match but sometimes i like to get number one just because it's lighter for the under eye area but guys if you find this and buy it you will not regret it the next thing i got were these three colorful eyeliners and it already came out of the box because it doesn't have good packaging but you know why these were three dollars three dollars i actually used this one today and it went on pretty good i mean for three dollars it did its job Ugh, i keep getting hair in my eyelashes so i got this one in bolt this one in strobe and this one in flash let me swatch it for you these do have a little brush which it's kind of hard to use these for me i'm so used to a felt tip eyeliner whatever though like i managed <laughs> You see how pigmented that is? Like, okay, Profusion. Oh, and I don't think I mentioned that. These are the Profusion Cosmetics Bright Lights UV Neon Light. Then this is the one I'm wearing right now. This is the only one I didn't like. It's pigmented, but it's a little clumpy already. So I don't know if it's just old or just the color. Whatever they used for this color, it just didn't work out. But you know what? $3, who cares? I don't know if you could see right there how it's clumpy. Yeah. So pretty though. So I don't know if I'll wear it though because if I struggled with this one, I don't know about this one. I recommend this guys. They're $3. Especially if you're someone that's always wanted to try colorful eyeliner but you're scared. And what if you don't like it? These are the ones. Next I got five... <laughs> Next, I got five eyelashes. Eyelashes? What in the world? <laughs> oh, God. Next, I have five nail polishes. The first one I got is from LA Colors, and this is in the color Fruity. And I don't know if you could tell, but it has, like, little confetti-looking things. And there's, like, a pastel green, orange, pink... I thought this would be perfect during the spring, especially during Easter. The next one is also from LA Colors, and this one is in the color Delicate, which is like a super nudie pink. It's so light. I thought this would be perfect for a lot of nail ideas I have because I see girls always rocking the new nails, and I want to try it. So I had another one. It's called Barefoot and Topless by Essie. But that one's not like a pink nude it's more on the brown side and i don't think that's my nude color because not every nude is for everyone so maybe this pink one will work next i have another one from la colors and this is in sugar plum fairy and it's basically purple glitter but then it has like holographic glitter so it like shifts from green to pink oh it's so pretty and i want these for like an accent nail and this one I matched with this one. This one is also from LA Colors and it's in the color Revolutionary. I love it so much. This actually kind of matches my hair right now. This is a wig, but my split thigh, one the purple side is kind of this color. So I was like, I have to get it. I'll be matching my hair. The next one is also from LA Colors, but this one's the gel ones. And this one is in the color Chill Out. And it's a super pretty like pastel teal, but it's super bright. It looks more blue on camera. It's more of a seafoam green in person. So, but 
these are really good honestly i wish they had all the other colors in these but the walmart i went to they only had like a few selection it was all like hot pink like bright colors and i already have enough bright colors so yeah so excited about these another staple for me in my makeup collection is this it's the elf wow brow this one's in the color neutral brown i really like the neutral brown because you could put it with a light eyebrow pencil dark eyebrow pencil it doesn't matter because it's neutral so i always alternate between this one and the deep brown so this was really good it has like little fibers so it makes it look like you have like little hairs oh my god it's amazing try it i really like doing face masks all the time so when i was there obviously i checked out the freeman stuff so i found these and i got three of them so i got two of these it's the rejuvenating cucumber and pink salt clay mask clay masks are my favorite i think it's the only ones i use i don't like the gel ones or like the hydrating ones those are not for me i have really oily skin so clay masks are the way to go and then I got this one. It's the charcoal and black sugar mud mask. What's the difference, guys? To me, a mud mask and a clay mask, it feels the same. It feels the same. <laughs> but yeah, these are amazing, actually. I tried these already because I got three of them. And the saw is like very good for exfoliating, let me tell you. Almost too good. <laughs> so I probably wouldn't use these all the time just when I really need that dead skin off my face. But they're so cheap. And it says this is only for one use. But I got two uses out of it, so get them. The last thing I got and the most exciting thing for me, it's a leopard bow. Leopard, cheetah, what animal are you? I don't know, but isn't it so cute? Now, I can actually talk about this now, but my sister's pregnant, so I was like walking around the baby aisle, you know, looking at things for her baby. I was like, oh my god, like what should I buy? And then I came across the bow section and I died. I legit died. If you know me, you know I love wearing bows all the time. So when I saw this one, I love bows, I love leopard, cheetah, whatever, I had to buy it. And then it's so big. So, yeah, I can't wait to wear it. Oh, this is so exciting. <laughs> okay, guys, that's it for my haul. Let me know in the comments if you tried any of those items I bought. Don't forget to give my video a thumbs up and comment whatever video you want to see. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, guys, and like my video. The more you like my video, the more it'll put it out there for other people to see, so that helps so much. And share my video, guys. I see you guys. I see all of you that are sharing it. Thank you so much. When I make it, I'm gonna remember all of you. So if I make it, all of you are gonna make it with me. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.